Hey Funko Pops, it is me, the Funko Monster, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Funko Pop Marvel 80 Years First Appearance Human Torch. Uh, or the original Human Torch, I misread it. But still, First Appearance Human Torch, the original Human Torch, and I think the original Human Torch is more uh, accurate because this is not who you think it is. So uh, I'm going to get into who he is in a couple minutes here, but uh, let's take a look at the packaging. You can see it has the 80 years of Marvel uh, packaging here, and it looks really cool. A lot of 80 years in, uh, in the year 2019, 2019, whatever. Uh, we got, you know, Batman 80 years and the Marvel 80 years, so a lot of things going on there. Anyways, it sucks. So, like, I remember five years ago, 75 years of Batman, oh my god. And I was like, oh my god, 75 years is a lot. And I'm like, nah, it's like 80. I'm like, oh shit, that was five years ago. Anyways, yeah, so the packaging is pretty cool. I like that it's not, you know, copying the Batman 80 years thing. I think that's more special, though. But still, 80 years of Marvel is still pretty impressive. Uh, but you can see it has the awesome uh, comic book cover right there which looks really cool which may confuse some people actually so uh let's get the pop out here and we'll take a look at the pop and it is a really cool looking pop too it looks very simple but there's a reason why all right so i looked this up on wikipedia now this is you know take it with a grain of salt but i mean it's comic books not like you're writing a report or anything so it says here that the human and human is in quote. The Human Torch was actually an android create. This is what it says on Wikipedia. Created by uh, scientist Phineas Horton, he possessed he possessed the ability to surround himself with fire and control flames. In his earliest appear appearances, he was portrayed as a science fiction monstrosity, but he quickly became a hero and adopted a secret identity as a police officer for the New York City Police Department. So, basically, it was an android, you know, being controlled, uh, from what it sounds like, being controlled by a scientist. Um, and then the scientist was the police officer. I can't, the ways, you know, it doesn't really tell a lot, but uh, he was around, when he was around, he was around in the 50s and then in 19... 61, Jack Kirby and Stan Lee, you know, took the name Human Torch and attached Johnny Storm and uh, to him and put him in the Fantastic Four, which I think, you know, that's where everyone knows him from. So, anyways, so this is actually the android Human Torch, not Johnny Storm, which I found really interesting. Because, I mean, you look at it, you can say, us, oh, both, you know, but no, it is not. So, it, it is the android uh, human torch, which I think is it's a really cool thing. Because I, I know that when I picked this guy up. I picked, I picked this guy up yesterday, so I thought this was human torch. But I was like, why, why is it original? Why are they being so, you know, you know, specific about that? But I looked it up and now I know why. But you can see the paint looks very clean. It just looks like... just bunch of flames and all that it looks like it was just pulled right out of the comic books you can see the hair very nice the hair the fire on the head looks very translucent very nice really like that and you can see the body there looks good all the lines look very clean crisp no flaws from what i see so far but looks good though you can see the ass there. There's a little thing right on the ass. But yeah, looks good though. I like the flames on the hands and everything. And you can see the flames around the feet. This is actually two separate pieces attached at the bottom there. But it looks really cool. I really do like that. Very nicely painted and everything. Very nicely sculpted as well. I was thinking about, I was thinking about picking up Namor too. But... I don't know, I think it's just one with this one only, because I don't, I don't really like Namor, I think he's just a knock, not a knockoff, but like, I like Aquaman better, you know, that's just my opinion, but yeah, very cool pop here, I am very happy I picked this up, I'm very happy, and another reason why I'm very happy I picked this up is because it's so deep into comic books, 
And I, I, you know, I love comic books and all that. But this is so deep into it that I didn't even know, you know. It was in the 50s and all that, you know. So, yeah, anyways. Very cool. I wonder when they are actually going to make the rest of the Fantastic Four Pops. I hope they do it soon because... Well, I mean, right now, I, I don't know. It's, it's, it's weird. I feel like if they did, it would have it would be like the Guardians of the Galaxy. They would all be exclusive. They would all be a little bit hard to find, and they'd be a little more expensive. But I think they shouldn't, you know, be retail. Like, like it, eighty years of Marvel would have been like, like this would have been the perfect time to release the Fantastic Four pops. But eh, whatever, it's fine. Um, but yeah, man, I I'm, I was very surprised to see that you know. This was not Johnny Storm, you know. Um, I really don't know. Um, so it says he was an android. Maybe the android was the one, you know, pretending to be... Was a police officer and all that. Um, like it says his alter ego was Jim Hammond. So, I don't know. He was in Secret Avengers, Heroes for Hire, Shield, um, West Coast Avengers, Invaders, you know, all that things. You know, it's so deep into comic books. I absolutely love it. Uh, thank you guys for watching this review. If you like this review, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Uh, you know, uh, I, I don't know. Like, I haven't been picking up a lot of pops recently. I'm trying to review the pops I get new. You know, because that's what people want to see, and you know, this is how I'm gonna get known, you know, all that. So, uh, yeah, like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, maybe I'll be posting an older review, you know, something that's not gonna get nearly as many views as I as this may, uh, or any of the few reviews I've posted recently. So, subscribe to see something to go back a little bit, throwback, all right. Anyways, uh, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Nice watching. Let's get this guy to turn around quicker. Like that. There we go.